this one mistake is probably costing you tons of sales in your business. In this video, I'm gonna show you why you might be pushing people away and then give you three tips to improve your approach. And at the end, I'd love to give you a free training that'll help you structure your pitch so you can make more sales. Do you remember in high school, there was like a super hot guy or a super hot girl and they had this type of energy about them that was just kind of like, I'm amazing, I'm so cool, I don't need you. Do you know what I'm talking about? They were practicing a principle that I like to call being leaned out. And because they were leaned out and they had this type of, I don't need you energy, what it did is cause other people to want to lean into them. Now, when I was in high school, unfortunately, I was the needy person. So I was super attracted to this amazing guy. Everybody else loved him too. They thought it was so cool. They thought he was so hot. And he had this type of, I don't need you energy, which caused me to be like leaning in to him, right? Like, like I'd position myself against the locker like conveniently as he was walking by to lunch. Did you ever do that? Or maybe you were the person that everybody wanted to date and everybody was leaning into. But here's the principle that nobody knew that was at work. The super hot guy and the super hot girl were practicing being leaned out. Now, how does this affect you in your business? When you embrace a leaned out energy in your speaking, in your selling, when you do your invitation, when you do your pitch, what it's going to do is cause the entire audience or the prospect on the call to lean into you because they will feel that you don't need them. You're good. Buy or don't buy, baby. I'm good. Get this or don't get this. This train is leaving. I don't need you to buy this. Now, you might be saying to me, Eileen, I 100% need them to buy this. And what I want to say to you is you may need to make sales, but you don't need to make that sale. There's 7 billion people in the world. There's many more people who will buy what you have to offer. There's many more people who will respect and value and appreciate you. So you don't need it that bad. This is what will enable you to stay leaned out. Here are my top three tips that will strengthen your approach and make you the person that's hard to get. Let's go. Number one, lower your voice, especially for my female friends out there. There's a study that shows that when women start to get like excited or especially when they go into a pitch, their vocal range increases in register, which starts to irritate the audience. So lower your register, lower your tone of voice, especially when you're going into the offer and into the pitch. Guys, you don't want to sound too excited or overly eager. Lowering your tone of voice puts you more into a state of authority and I'm taking you somewhere, so go ahead and follow me. The second tip, divorce yourself from the outcome. What do I mean? I mean, have no need for the prospect or the audience to do anything. Completely unattach from them applauding you, liking you, celebrating you, diving in, buying your thing. Be 100% divorced from the outcome and they will feel your lack of neediness and start to lean in. Here's the takeaway, neediness kills all deals. Let's dive into tip number three. Have some type of application or some type of questions that the prospect needs to apply to work with you. You don't wanna be like on the market and be like, yo, I'm just gonna date whoever, like you come at me, bro. No, you wanna have people apply, qualify, prove to you why they would be amazing for you to work with them, why they would be an incredible asset to the community, what they're going to give, how generous they're going to be with their gifts and talents. And you don't want anybody to just buy your stuff. Have them apply. If you'll do these three things, you're going to start seeing people move toward you. You're going to start seeing people be attracted to you. You're going to start seeing people lean into you, your content, your offers, and your coaching, consulting, or services because they're going to sense you don't need them. They can just relax. They can just be themselves. So lean out. Don't be needy. And I guarantee you're going to crush your sales, grow your business, and start to scale more quickly. If you would like my help and all my best speaking and selling tips, click the link below inside the description. I've got some free training that I'd love to send you so you can increase your sales and grow your business.